And I just want to show you how you can make a quick cheese omelet in our breakfast maker. You can find um, a breakfast maker on my website, which I've linked below if you don't have one yourself already. Um, the breakfast maker is uh, it's really cool and it makes um, it quick and easy to make breakfast. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm just going to put three eggs in the breakfast maker. Since I'm trying to make an omelet, what I do is I just use a fork and kind of scramble the eggs. Just kind of blend them all together. Now I know some people put milk in their omelets and I don't do that. I just cook them. I just mix them together like this and cook them. So all I have to do now is put the cover on. I'm going to put it in the microwave for two minutes. And I'll be right back and you can see what they look like when they're done. Okay, so this is what it looks like after I put it in the microwave for two minutes. Now I'm going to put some shredded cheese. I use the Mexican blend cheese. You can see that. And I keep my quarter cup measuring cup in the bag and then I just put cheese on there and my husband and I are big cheese lovers so the cheese on there I'm put the cover back on and I'm gonna put it in the microwave for 30 seconds microwave I always open the cover pointing in the opposite direction of me so any of the hot steam that's coming out will not just come up on my face and maybe burn me because that would not be fun. So this is the omelet now that it's done and I just get my spatula and kind of go around the edges because sometimes the melted cheese is there on the edges and then I can just slide it right onto a plate. See how easy that was to just slide onto the plate? Hope you saw that. Okay, so there is the cheese omelet. Um, if I was making it for the kids, I would just cut that in half and make it one. But since it's my husband and I, I will make a second one now. And one of the things that I really like about this is I can just get a paper towel and wipe this out. It's so much easier than a frying pan on the stove to wipe it out. See how easy that was to wipe out? And now I can go ahead and make a second omelet for myself. So I hope that this um, was a nice little easy simple recipe for you. Again, if you don't have a breakfast maker,